Okay. Look, um, my name is Václav, my first name, and Marhol is my surname. I am I am a director from the Czech Republic, and I directed the movie called The Painted Bird. And uh, I would like to say, because many people really ask me, you know, so. And uh, they really touch by the, all those scenes with the animals. And of course, I must say that no animal been really harmed, you know. And I, of course, I can say everything what I would like to say. <laughs> but, but of course, because I expected that we will have troubles with that. Because after three days after the world premiere in uh, Venice, I have received the first email from some organization which is protecting the animals. And they said, what happened with Fredka on the very, uh, on the very beginning of the movie? And I said, look, what do you want to know? Because we made the uh, uh, everything we do have in a camera, we, everything we do have in a photographs, you know, that no animal been harmed and everything is okay and all animals are really are still living. And that's the same with the horse, or it doesn't matter with any animal in my movie. So that's a very, it's really important to say that I do have evidence and I can prove to anybody, to anybody around the world, that no animal been harmed. Secondly, what I would like to say, and it was so, so nice and so cute what happened to Venice, because the painted bird been awarded in Venice and uh, been awarded by the student jury. I mean, the very young Italian people from 70 to 20 years old. Nine boys and nine girls, and been selected from 2,000 young people around uh, across the Italy. And they said, look, we are going to award your movie because your movie is about humanity and your movie is protecting the child around the world, you know. And I was so touched and so pleased, so pleased that all those wonderful young people, they said it, you know. I said, look, maybe the world in the future is going to be better because of you. And the third, what I would like to say, and I'm still facing, that many people are saying, your film is too violent and too brutal. And I said, really? Are you really sure? Because I am not showing this, uh, these things on the screen. No, ne no, never. And I said, look, it's always the camera is behind the scene. So it's not on the screen. It's on your mind, you know. It's definitely up to you how far and how deep you will imagine what's going on on the screen because I hate those scenes you know I mean that you from the front view you will see that somebody is killing some anybody else doesn't matter you know so it's not on the screen and that's but the the people are still saying you know and so it's a little bit you know I don't understand it you know because maybe but I will tell no sorry in other words that's it you know the Painted bird, the difference between the painted bird and the all other movies which are much more violent and they are bringing much more brutality to the audience, it's a fairy tale, it's a fiction. And the uh, problem, let's say, of the painted bird, this story is truthful because it happens and it will happen. And now when we are doing this interview, so in this very second, the Kurds, the Turkish soldiers are killing the Kurds in this second in this second, the children are going to be murdered or burned, you know. So this is why the painted bird is a timeless story. And our eyes, we simply, we can't close our eyes, you know. We have to, we have to think of it. We must, we must, we must, uh, we must struggle with it, you know. And that's what the painted bird is about, you know. It's very painful. I know that. It's painful. It's but we right. must do that. And dot. Thank you very much. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs>